Well, here we are, midday, 28th of August, 2020. Um, thank you for joining me or watching later, whenever that will be. Um, you know, one year ago, as so many of you know, we um, didn't even have a catalog or a single product to give you. We were a couple of days away from the Christmas showcase, but we had, let me just straighten this out. I think what, what it is, is that Jeff Owen has been in the building and he messes about with things. I expect him to turn up any minute now, but anyway, that's another story. So one year ago, we were just about to have our Christmas showcase. We had no products, no catalogs, literally nothing to give you. Of course, by then we'd already secured um, the Clean Easy branded chemicals, which were at that time going to be exclusive to us, which still are in many respects, the chemical branding is still exclusive to us. Um, so that was one year ago. We barely had anything. And here we are. I'm going to now talk about in a moment about the latest catalogs about to come out Christmas 2020, which is literally days away. Although I do understand a couple of scamps in the office want to reveal something today um, and products in general. And of course, the forthcoming showcase, which we all need to know about. And we're waiting for government guidelines, of course. So one year ago no products, no catalogues. And on the 13th of September, I recall giving you a 20 page Christmas catalogue. And that's what we launched the entire newer reinvigorated version of this business, a 20 page catalogue. Um, and it had didn't have many products in it. But that's where we started literally one year ago. Yes, we know the business has been going for two years. However, however, there were multiple shenanigans in the first year. So the reinvigorated version was launched on the 31st of August 2019. Um, and all we had going in our favour was two massive things. One, a network that wanted to work with us and still love the concept of Viva MK. Uh, and along the network, I also put with that a bunch of people at work at head office that are dedicated to the brand. So dedication from people. And we had, of course, on our side, the Clean Easy brand, which was an absolute delight to bring back on that day exclusive to us, which really was the precursor to our entire launch of the second version, the newer version, the better version of Viva MK, where like I promise you, it was only ever going to be you and me in the business. No more shenanigans, no more people telling us what to do, nothing getting in the way, just running the business entirely the way that we want to, a true ethos of the people's business, which is what we have now done for a year. And no matter what has happened in that year, whether it's been people, um, you know, try attempting to uh, um, deploy you within their businesses, selling anything and everything, filling out your inboxes, infiltrating you like circling vultures or a worldwide pandemic. Either way, we're still here on the 28th of August. So let's talk about catalogues first. Um, next week, you will get the full PDF, PDF of Christmas 2020. The full PDF is coming your way. And I do believe um, our target for mid-September for physical catalog is still on target. Our biggest uh, Christmas catalog, 48 pages. Like I said, to think we launched with 20 pages a year ago. Um, I do believe um, a couple of the staff will let you have the front and back cover today. There's nothing like um, peer pressure and of course uh, network support for those kind of things so I do believe that's going to be today so you get a visual on exactly what the catalogue is going to look like and then of course next week the full pdf is scheduled to land with you so you'll know exactly what you've got we'll also set some of those products live before the physical catalogues come your way because we've already invested in the majority of products no to be fair we've invested in all of the products in that catalogue and we're just awaiting them to come in. Now, 
putting a Christmas catalogue together, as the team will tell you, through a worldwide pandemic where most suppliers and manufacturers were actually shut down, was near enough impossible. But it took a lot of perseverance from the staff, nothing, nothing to do with me, I was just a hindrance. Total perseverance from the staff, complete dedication and a commitment to get it done. So that was being put together in April and May. As you know, you know, the rest of the world was shut down. So getting that together was a phenomenal, phenomenal event to actually get it together to where we have today. And when you see uh, the front cover or whatever it is going to be, slipped out to you today you'll see that you know the team have done an exceptional job of that i do believe it's going to be a phenomenal um season um it's just one of the things happening this season just one of the things that are going to come your way um there's so much so many plates spinnings that we are currently doing um in the business to help you know continue motivating our sales and of course keep motivating you and the business so yes it's been a strange all year it's been an incredible year in some ways and throughout that um weird last five months that will always be um some the, one of the strangest things that's happened to any of us um of course the team continued putting together catalogs and sourcing products for you it's a great selection of products it really is um, we've taken into account many of the things that you've asked for along the way of course you can never get everything you know we have a list that's um 5,000 products long and everything from the obvious to the completely bizarre of course it just makes you laugh some of the things that sometimes people request from us um i'm very nervous because i do expect jeff owen to turn up at any minute any given moment he'll turn up behind me but anyway so Christmas 2020, you're going to get a visual of the front and back cover today. You're going to get a full PDF next week. And I do believe only a matter of days after that. So in the following week, or I think the, the, the date is the week after, and we'll give you the date, you'll actually get the physical catalog in your hands with all of the products live already. So it's going to be a great season, but that's not all we're working on. Let me tell you about beauty. The current version of the beauty catalog, which again was launched during the pandemic. And as you recall, was an absolute nightmare to get together because of closed down factories, suppliers not working, masses of people furloughed. We know the story. Um, so we got it together. And of course, that's been a huge success. And, uh, you know, thank you to the wonderful beauty brand directors who promote that catalog and the products within it all of the time. You have made more of a difference than you realize. Um, so that catalog is coming to it to an end, not as a production, but as the quantity of catalogs we've had. We have shifted 150,000 individual copies of that catalog. And to put that into perspective, well, I can't really, I'm just telling you, it's an absolutely huge number for something that was launched halfway through the pandemic when most people weren't actually even doing a great deal. So we're coming to the end of that. It's a, it may even run out in the next few days. So we're relaunching a second version of that. So the second version of that is being worked on as we speak. And in that second version, we've managed to put some of the products that you've constantly, constantly been telling us about, especially the beauty brand directors who advise us on some of the things that should be on there. So yes, we will have face cleansers. Yes, we will have antibacterial brushes. Yes, we will have some men's products. And yes, we will have some general makeup removers and face cleansers. So those kind of things are going to be added in it. There will be a few days delay, but we're still trying to get that ready for around about mid-September again. So mid-September, there's a lot of things happening. A new version of beauty, and of course, Christmas will be in your hands. Um, with beauty, it's such a wide area, as you know, and you know, I've been in beauty for many years myself um, in various companies, and there's so many hundreds of products that we can include. But the best thing is, and this goes with any of our catalogs and any of our products, that we have the flexibility to change things, to add things, to bring things in and work 
with small suppliers that want to build their businesses and the candles were a great are a great example of that you know working with a small supplier who was given the biggest orders they have ever had so you know not only are your customers happy with the great product you're happy with the great product but in turn we've been able to help a very small supplier who's never had order sizes the big as, as big as we're giving them and that's what we try to do with any of our new product innovations and let me tell you a little bit about product innovation that's one area like the virucidal spay like the eco-friendly products like the candles and various other things that we've got in the pipeline they're all being worked with fairly small organizations that really needed our supply and demand. So it's fantastic. Like I said, it works in three ways. Your customers are happy. You're happy because they're quality products. But, you know, equally as importantly, we can help small suppliers. Now, huge companies can't do that. They can't just make decisions as quick as that and this is one of the beauties of being in this situation that we are in that we can make decisions very fast you know some of the people that want to work with us for future coming product innovation are working with us because we make decisions so fast there's no board to impress there's a number of us that talk about it in the office people that know what they're talking about and sometimes we make those decisions within hours of getting a proposal no company can work like that you know even in previous brands that I've worked in it can take up to six months to even get an answer to say yes about going forward so this is the brilliant thing and this is why sometimes we can get products turned around so quickly and the virucidal was a great example of that you know a high performing um very strongly based um chemical based product which was absolutely vital for safety and perception when we launched that and it's still doing exceptionally well but we not only made that decision very very quickly we were able to work with a supplier that absolutely helped their cash flow because we were buying from them we were the first departure in the domestic market for that company and the same goes for the eco products you know they, they these are big um they normally have industrial manufacturing and for both companies we were the first departure into the domestic market so like i said customers happy you happy suppliers happy and along the way we've actually been able as an organization all of us help the entire supply chain and that's a great place to be we don't have to deal with huge corporations we can deal with small individual suppliers helping them along the way so that's the beauty book and christmas book both coming your way where the beauty book is more of a refurb um, but it'll have a lot more new products in it including some things that you've been asking for such as face cleaners and so on and so on uh, christmas obviously you're going to get visual of that but in the meantime those two catalogs are what i would call well in production the big one of course is going to be spring 2021 because you have to think ahead i know it's very strange thinking of spring 2021 when we're barely even through the summer and nowhere near christmas as a season but 2021 and there'll be more news of that of course in weeks to come is in my humble opinion going to be our real biggie you know it's going to be the one that's got even more innovation in it it's going to have even more products in it and it's going to be there not only supporting small suppliers making your customers happy and most importantly of course making you guys happy because you are our customer and you always will be so that's the big one and we're aiming to get that to you before the end of the year i'm not going to give you a date as to when the end of the year but that is scheduled for the end of this year so big things happening where catalogs are concerned but outside of catalogs let's just have a quick conversation about products there's a number of products we're working on um and in my head 
which is usually different to anybody else's because I've always got my dates wrong. But in my head, the ideal time to launch those will be at the showcase, whatever form the showcase takes. So in my head, the target for releasing new products to you that you haven't seen before is going to be the 3rd of October. And I'll talk about the showcase in a minute. And when it comes to product innovation, it's not just about um, creating the next new cleaning product, although that is always a great idea. It's about um, implementing more of our own brand, because as you've already noticed with anything that has our brand name on it, the products are good quality, whether it's the eco range, whether it's the candles, where, whether it's the virucidal, or even the antibacterial hand gel that we now uh, have branded as our own. Um, so what I get most excited about is our own brand recognition. So my target for brand new products that you've never seen before is 3rd of October and that's what we're aiming for. So there's a lot happening where catalogs are concerned, there's a lot happening where products are concerned, there's a lot happening generally in the business. Uh, much of it I will reveal to you on the 3rd. Um, now, the showcase, let's talk about the showcase. This, of course, naturally will be the most precariously put together showcase imaginable, not because I work in a precarious way, I do as well, but not just because of that, but because as you know, the government guidelines and the situation in the country with social distancing and so on. I've still got multiple venues. I originally booked 12 venues. That's now come down to eight uh, because Four of them flatly refused to have any such gathering as early as that, especially whilst the government guidelines are not straightforward um, and nobody actually knows what's going to happen. Another venue came back to me saying they're more than pleased to go ahead with the showcase. They're really delighted as long as we keep the numbers to 30. I have more than that in my own bedroom, let alone at a showcase. So anyway, that wasn't, I don't know why I said those things, but anyway, that, that that's just not... Um, the case at the moment. We, we obviously can't have a showcase for 30 people. Um, so we're still waiting. I hope to have more news on that next week, but in, it's entirely because of the situation in the country. You know, as you know, there is no organization probably in the world, I hasten to add, probably in the world that has had an event yet where people are sat in reasonable close proximity. And there's certainly very few people having legal, legal dinners um, and get togethers of that variety. Um, so we're just, it's a waiting game. You know, we all want a showcase. We all want to get together. The, the venues that I've got in mind are all very good venues, um, of course, but none of them know how it's going to pan out. On the 1st of October, restrictions are lifted, but no one knows how the lifting of those restrictions is actually going to affect rooms full of people. Now, you can have huge rooms with social distancing, but, you know, it's all very, very precarious, especially when it comes to um, dinners and getting together and all that. So hopefully we'll have more information. But like I've always said to you, one way or another, we'll be having an event. Everything from a virtual event all the way to a physical event. One way or another, we will be getting together on the 3rd of October. And just so you know, and I won't reveal just now, um, either way, we have a guest speaker booked, um, which I think is going to be really good for us. Uh, you know, some fa fa uh, fantastic things in this person's portfolio. Um, I know I've made mistakes with guest speakers before, but not this time. Uh, so that, that that's really something to look forward to. And either way, whether this guest speaker has to appear virtually or face to face, this person is booked for all of that. So one way or another, we will have a guest speaker and you'll know more about that in the coming weeks. So as a business, um, no, it's not been a straightforward time. It hasn't been for anybody. It's been a really awkward and strange and bizarre time as it has been for every individual that, that has been you know, got come through the pandemic, which is all of us, everything has been unusual and everything has been those three words, adapting, changing and evolving. And that's what we've had to do. Like I've said to you before, if anybody had said that we'd be selling 
hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of face masks. I would never have believed it even back in January. There's no chance we would have ever have believed that or that we would be creating our own virucidal spray um, to combat against enveloped viruses. I didn't even know what an enveloped virus was in January, let alone formulating a brand to attack such a virus. So the world has changed very fast. I don't believe it's going to go back to normal overnight. We have to keep ad adapting, changing and evolving, but we will do. And you'll see that in some of the ongoing product selections and things that we're having to do in the business to kind of stay one step ahead. But that is completely down to you and your support, which is absolutely I, you know, I cannot thank you enough or show you enough gratitude of how connected and amazing our network of people is, not just to us, but to each other. You know, you've got the business through, you've got yourselves through. And for that, I can't believe that anybody has done it in the way that we collectively have. Then secondly, of course, you know, there's a phenomenal team that work with me. Um, yes, they plot against me sometimes to um, get products out prematurely or visuals out when, they, when they're told not to. But, you know, nevertheless, they are totally committed to the business and to going forward. I would say that in this changing world and in this changing business, the one thing we've always got to bear in mind is we've got to continuously think of this change and this evolution and this adapting. And if we can do that with safety and perception in mind, which is always going to be in people's minds now, it doesn't matter where the pandemic finishes or draws out, that fear of things like that happening are not going to go away. I think that's prevalent in every area of life. So if we can constantly adapt, change and evolve, bear in mind safety and perception, I truly believe sticking together, we will win this year and going into next. And looking at some of the product selections for 2021, we're on to an absolute winner as long as we keep doing what we do. So, Am I happy with business? I'm always delighted with what's happening in the business. Absolutely delighted. Even in the face of all the challenges that the world has witnessed over the last six months. So my only plea to you is, is that in this highly competitive arena that we're all in, and remember, I want to move away from the, the, the tarred, um, the, the tarred ethos of network marketing. I want our own ethos. There's no reason why we can't have our own ethos of what we do, of the true people's business connecting together. So I want to move away from all that tarnished industry. Um, but the point is, you know, you're always going to be a target. Of course you are, because you're well connected, you're buoyant people, you're inspired, you're motivated. Everybody's going to always want you in their businesses. Why wouldn't they? Of course they would. Um, but the great thing is, you know that my door is open. I mean, literally, because Jeff Owen comes and goes. But my door is literally always open. So if you ever have any query, any kind of worry, anything going through your mind, you know that you can contact me direct and we can talk about it. And the last few weeks, um, maybe even months now, that has accelerated massively. The amount of times that I've had to talk to people and, and talk them through it um, and reassure people. So please feel free. If there's something niggling you, just get in contact. You know, even go through distributor services if you haven't got my email address. But my email address isn't difficult to find. mk at vivamknetwork.com. You've had it a thousand times and hundreds of you make contact with me. Please carry on doing so because that is the one connection I never, ever, ever want to lose. And what makes me more determined is just recently, I've been trying to make contact with three fairly large companies. 
and I've made contact with them time and time and time again and still no reply for anybody in one of them I can't even work out who is it that you can make contact with I can't even get any names but you know that I'm always here and that we can always connect that is something that is very unique about our business so don't sit there wondering or worrying or having concerns make direct contact and we can talk through anything you want to talk through and that is something unique about our business so have a fantastic bank holiday i've told you about the catalogs you'll get a visual of it today um against my wishes of course but next week the full pdf christmas is soon to be with us still targeted for the middle of september if not before uh, closely followed by the, the, the refurbished version of Beauty with all the extra products in that I've just told you about whilst we work on spring 2021 and at the same time on the 3rd of October not only will we have a guest speaker whether we're face to face or virtual and I will tell you all about all the new products that are coming your way um, before the end of this year. Anyway, thank you for everything you do. I really appreciate it. This is, in my humble opinion, the greatest connection in business that connects and, and, and exists out there for what we have achieved in this one year and especially what we've achieved in this year alone. Let's keep that going. You've always got my support as I know that I have yours. Thank you, everybody. Take care. Have a fantastic uh, bank holiday weekend.